Hello, everybody, and welcome to Five Nights at Freddy's Into the Pit. Now, before we get started, uh, let me just say this. As of recording this video, it is um, August 13th. Um, I really wanted to play this when it first came out on the actual anniversary. Unfortunately, it was $20 on Steam. Even on the anniversary, it was $20, which I, at the time, only had five. But recently, I've got some more money on Steam, so I got into the pit. Um, I've had it in the pit now for like, I've had the game now for like a few days. Um, I haven't been able to play it because of school. So, we are going to spend the next three hours playing this game. Now, let me just make this clear, so of you, if you have not seen the um, update video of what's next to the channel. I will not be, this is not going to be something that I haven't really said entirely, but I will not be playing through the entire game. Yeah, I will not be 100%ing this game. I will not be playing through the entire game. I'm just going to sit here for the next three hours and see how much that I get through. Um, so consider this most likely into the pit part one. Um, now obviously multiple people have already played the game. There's been, um, I've seen like notifications from people like Raito about like into the pit explained and all that. I have not watched those videos though. I do not know anything about this game except for what the trailer has shown and, you know, what, like, the theme page and all that reads. I don't know what the gameplay is like. I don't know what the story is like. I don't know anything about this game. So, I purposely avoided watching those videos to not ruin the experience. Because, from what I have seen of just the title of videos, this is a damn good game, and obviously it looks like a damn good game, and it's a 10th anniversary game. But people, I've seen things online that say, like, this game is really good and all that, so... Very excited. Um, got a little half jump scare from Spring Bonnie when I opened the game. Cool. Um, let's hope this works. Oh, also, one more thing. Um, I tried to do the Five Laps at Freddy's demo, and it didn't work. Now, it was not the same thing as the T-Jock demo. With the T-Jock demo, I tried to actually get into it, it wouldn't open. Um, the, the T-Jock demo won't let me open it. I don't know why. For Five Laps, though, it was something different. Um, for Five Laps, I could open the game, but as soon as I opened the game, as soon as I opened it, I had nothing else open on the computer. No tabs, no windows, no nothing, not even OBS. Just the game. Just five laps. And it was laggy as hell. I couldn't do shit because it was so laggy. Like, I saw like the first, probably like the first like, when I hit play on the game menu of five laps, it took me like a solid five minutes to actually do anything, and I saw like one frame, and I was like, oh shit, no, nope, no, 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 we don't want to spoil ourselves here. Because I knew right then and there I wasn't going to be doing that video, which sucks, because that's something I'm really looking forward to. So I'm going to have to wait until either, um, it could have just been like something to do partly with the demo itself. So maybe there will be like a, you know, patches of the demo at some point that might make it run smoother. Or maybe there's something I can do. I don't know. So hopefully I can do a video on the demo in the future. Um, if not, then I'll have to wait till when the full game releases in 2025. Uh, also, 
the Scott Coffin interview reaction video is still not released yet. I know at this point it's been like almost two weeks since I posted anything, and I deeply apologize for that. Um, I just had technical difficulties with editing things, and I've also not had that much time because of school. Um, you know, getting up at 5.30 in the morning and not getting back until like 3. Yeah. Anyway. Um, let's get into this. Ooh, that looks nice. That looks cool. Never the same hope I will drain from you into the pit. I must admit, I come anew. Yes, I know that song by heart. Um, including Kyle Allen music into this song as well. Okay. Um, real quick, let me go into settings here. What the hell? Okay, I've never seen that in a game before. I'm like, I've watched this. I'm moving the scroll wheel. And it's like, not scrolling down, but... I've never seen a game do that before, that's cool. That's interesting. Um, kind of annoying, but oh well. Wait, what the hell? Oh, okay. That's just general. Um... I can turn it down later if need be. I think it's fine right now. Uh, here we go. Interactive E, flashlight F, inventory I. Whenever I think of inventory I, it just, I instantly just think of Minecraft, because that's what, um... The inventory key was originally for that in the old day. Map? There's a map in this game? Run and shift, quest and keep. Quest? Ooh, logs? What the hell is this game? Oh my god. Okay. WASD. Okay. Accessibility. Uh, default doesn't matter. Hint rate. 18, oh, I read that as 18, that says 10. 10 minutes by default, doesn't matter. Um, audio visualization. What's that? What's, what's audio visualization? Hmm. I don't know what that is. The default is off. Uh, I don't think you really need anything. Run mode is hold, yes. Hiding mini games. Default. Okay. What is audio visualization? I have no idea. Um, so, again, this is most likely going to be a part one. So, let me, let me know. There will most likely be um, more parts to this in the near future. So let me know down let me know down in the comments um if audio visualization if this is important. Let me know if this is important. Um or maybe I'll find out in a bit, I don't know, but just let me know if it's important. And I'll turn it on in part two. Yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Uh shall we dive into the pit? Experience adjust the slider until you can barely see the sensor image. I would call that just barely so. 
Okay. Um, difficulty. They're creepy and they're frightening. So, frightening is, I guess, the default of balanced experience. Creepy is a narrative experience. I do also know that there's more than one ending. I mean, obviously, we knew that from the get-go. So, there are multiple endings to this game, so I wonder... So what's the difference between a balanced experience and a narrative experience? Hmm. Hold on. I'm not going to, obviously... Obviously, I'm going to avoid spoilers. I'm just going to look up, like, which one I should do. But, like, let me see if I can find something that says it. Um... Okay, creepy versus frightening and see what pops up. Again, the, the top thing I see is uh, like the top of a Reddit post and it says, if I recall correctly, frightening is literally just normal mode. Or the other one is easy mode. Ah. Okay. Okay, so frightening is normal, creepy is easy. And what throws me off is the difference in the description. Because frightening says balanced, and creepy says narrative. Obviously, when I hear the word narrative, I immediately just think, LORE! Um, but, you know. I just go for it. Are you sure you want to proceed with these difficult tests? Okay. You might have to play this game more than once, I don't know. I mean, if we're getting multiple endings, then yeah, probably. What the hell is my computer doing? Prologue! Ooh. Can't something interesting happen around here for once? Oh, well, it's time to go. Ooh, I like this. This kind of, um, this kind of reminiscent of FNAF 4, in a way. Those animations! Ooh, has he seen the Yellow Rabbit 4, or is this like a... in the future, maybe? Isn't there anywhere else I can go? The pizza was good the first couple of times. Oh, I really want to do something new. I feel like this is very, um... Like a modernized version of FNAF 4. That's what I'm kind of getting from this. These animations, though, this is good. Holy hell. Aw, oh, come on, Oz. Just can't be the worst place to hang out. Same as last words. Every day has been the same all summer long. I go in, get pizza, stare at the grease stained yellow wall for hours, then wait for you to pick me up. Yeah, by the way, I've never personally read Into the Pit myself, but I do loosely know, like, the basics of what the story is. <clears throat> I do loosely, like, basically know what the story is. Why... Who, who leaves their kid at a pizza place? Like, who leaves their kid alone at a restaurant? Even if it's, like, an old, somewhat abandoned restaurant, who leaves their child alone in a restaurant? Like, that is not a good idea. Like, Oswald's father, what are you thinking? What's the fun in that? I'm glad school school's starting tomorrow, just so I only have to see that place on the weekend. Now, that's funny, actually, because school, like, just started. Um, especially, like, this came out a few days after school started. That's really funny. Um, alright. I'm sorry, son. I know no kids only option for fun should be hanging around a rundown pizza joint, but just all just 
what the hell. But Jets is all we got. It's all we can afford. Right. Because, um, the Oswald, Oswald family is poor, if I remember correctly. Again, I've never read Into the Pit myself. I have the uh, Silver Eyes. I do not have Price or Tail yet. Hopefully I will at some point. Uh, here we go. Continuing. You know money's been tight since the mill closed. One time full time at the corner store. Hmm. The mill club. That doesn't sound familiar. That doesn't sound familiar to me. And no, I'm not making a mill pun. I'm not. If I was really being cringy, I would, but no. If the corner store even survives that long, everything in this town is dead or dying. There's no telling what's closing next. So, um, where does you know, the pit take place? Because I know FNAF, like, in the game, it takes place in Hurricane Utah, or Huracan, or however you pronounce it, I don't know. Um, where did the pit take place? Oh, uh, down below. Because honestly, I don't remember. Why can't we go to the next town over where everyone else is moving? All my friends are there now. It can't be that hard for Grandma to travel a few miles. Well, unless her frail bones strengthen overnight, moving is a no-go. Okay. Mmm, be quiet. Can't we just pack Grandma up in some bubble wrap? <laughs> you know, you know what you should do. You should get one of those big, like, um, transparent. Um, not rubber. Um, like bubble balls. You should get one of those transparent bubble balls. You should put her in it, and you should just roll her around. Oh, that'd be so damn funny. <laughs> that would be so funny to see in a FNAF game. Someone should make an animation of that. Someone should make an animation of Oswald's grandma in a bubble ball being rolled around town. That'd be hilarious. Ah, if only it were that easy. Even with the mighty strength of bubble wrap, she's still too fragile, and that's what I'm going to change. I still can't go over the whole bubble wrap thing. That's gonna stick with me. I try all the time in um, project things, especially as Logan, um, Doctor Logan. Yeah. Speaking of things not changing, I bet that opossum's still on the corner at the spotlight. Correct me again, what is an opossum? I honestly forgot. This is not the way I was expecting the game to start. This is cool. Oh yeah? Let's... That's not right. Oh yeah, let's make a deal. If that critter's still there, I'll give you an extra buck for another slice of Jeff. Okay. That's what I get from that one. Okay. Or Jackson. Okay. Yeah. What the hell? Oh, so that's when open. Amanda. Amanda the Adventurer 2. Okay, yeah. Still there? Still dead. Still dead. Okay. Like Oswald said, everything in the town's dead or dying. Things will get better, Oz. What about the Wizard of Oz? That's why I think every time he said Oz, every time he calls him... Every time he calls him Oz, the hell is wrong with my voice today? Every time the dad calls him Oz, I immediately mean, just think of the Wizard of Oz. I don't know why. Well, they can't get any worse. Oh, let me set a timer. So that, um, actually... 
No, I know when we'll end, actually. I have a plan. Well, they can't get any worse. That's the spirit. Wait, what? Ooh, okay. Now we're just in the perspective of just he's in the car now. What kind of dad am I if I can't make him happy, let alone afford to feed him more than the I'm sorry things turned out this way, Oswald. Hmm. I'm a big nerd when it comes to FNAF lore. Holy shit. Well, wait again, Dad. That's cool, that's nice. See, I'm telling you, these animations... Okay, well, I was about to say, where's my mouth? These animations, I'm also going to analyze, like, every single frame here. So, I see... stuff... Uh, a kettle... pan... Did that say pan patch? Oh, no, 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 that says pan peach. Okay, I'm stupid. I thought it's a pan patch. Pan stand and pig patch together. Yeah. Um I can beat over there and pull you, don't we? Mm. Um I'm a big nerd with FNAF, I am all about the lore, so I'm gonna really be I'm gonna be like, you know, someone like Matt Pat just analyzing everything. Um Okay. This is good so far. Wait it. Whoa, whoa, ho, 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 hold up. Father? Okay, I'm confused. Wait, what? Because that said dad before. Is this a priest now? I'm confused. I don't know if that's like a little, um, continuity error or what. Remember when this was the place to be? Oh, okay. Or maybe they're just changing it to father and mother. Here's Oswald's mother. Totally, my parents took me here all the time. I still remember playing in the ball pit and getting ringworm. Ringworm? What? What's ringworm? A fungal infection of the skin that may affect skin, hair, and nail. Hmm. Interesting. Never heard of a ringworm. I don't think, I don't know. I used to love ball pits, honestly. But you know, I'm 15, so I can't really play around in ball pits anymore. Except for this one. Ew, probably why it's still roped off. That and well, you know. So my question is, where are his parents right now? Why are we seeing their text boxes if we don't see them on confused? Hmm. A secret ball pit. Oh, okay, that must be like some sort of memory kind of thing. A secret ball pit, huh? Ooh, now we get into the actual stuff. Look for the ball pit. Into the pit. Ooh. Oh, this is gonna be weird. Is it just me or do I walk slow? I feel like I do. Okay. Ooh, this is neat. Um, so this is the dining area. We have entrance, party hallway, kitchen, ball pit, backstage, basement, security, storage, and arcade. I want to explore all this before we go to the ball pit first. What's this? Inventory. That's the map. Oh, here's some logs. Oh, okay. This is kind of like Subnautica. This is, um... Yeah, okay. Oh, speaking of which, I actually recorded Subnautica episode 24, um, a little while ago, so, yeah. Here's quest. Look for the ball pit. 
I overheard people in Jeff talking about an old ball pit in the restaurant sometime. Could be neat to check out. Wait. Oh, maybe it was the, maybe the mother and the father are the two people sitting at the table next to him. Maybe that's what that was. I don't know. It's hard to say. Okay. And that's just settings. Okay, so I want to go, let's go to the entrance. Yeah, I guess that is a mother and father. Okay, I want to go to the entrance. Because I want to see, um, I, I really feel like I walk slow. But I can run. I'm probably going to walk though if I don't miss something. I'm really going to check every single corner. Okay, there's that. Vegan, pizza, pizza yum. Okay, so looks like we got a water thing. Um, deer antlers? Condiments? Coffee machine, maybe? Pictures? I don't know, it's hard to tell. Okay, so I guess let's go... Hello! Can I speak with you? Yes, I can. Oh, that's Jeff himself. Nice. You want another slice of cheese and a refill on the orange soda? Why does he look so tired? Why does he look like me in the morning? JK, I... Um... I'd probably get like, I don't know... Seven hours of sleep? I don't know. I have to get up at 5.30 in the morning. And I tell you, no matter how much sleep, no matter how early I go to bed, I am tired as hell when I wake up. It's awful. Whatever. Not right now, just checking around. Yeah, because... The hell is that? But yeah, because, um... People would definitely be okay with someone, some random kid just walking around. Although maybe that's normal in this universe, I don't know. Well, have fun. Not much to look at other than dust bunnies and cobwebs. I don't think they bite. Is it lagging? I feel like it might be a little, um, perfect. The dust bunnies? What is that noise? Oh, his mouth was moving, I just noticed. What the hell keeps making that noise? Weird. No, the wolf spiders. This guy is fucking with you. Jeff, don't definitely bite. Oh, good luck then. Is that all you got to say? Okay. Wait. Hey kid, if you aren't buying something, then at least keep yourself in. Okay. Um... Where are we currently? So this is the entrance. I guess we gotta go that way? I don't know, it's hard to say. I guess we... Or we can go that way, technically. Can we go this way, though? Oh, we can go... To, oh, okay, this is gonna be interesting. Um... Let's go this way. I promised... I promised Dad that I'd stay here until he came to get me. Can't leave yet. Might as well go check out that ball pit. Okay. I'm just gonna, like, see... I'm just gonna milk this 
dialogue that sounded a lot dirtier than I meant. Uh, <laughs> okay, so that is that. Let's go through this way, I guess. This door is locked. Ooh. Okay, this door is locked. Does it still say the same thing, though? Yeah, okay. So we need to find a key from somewhere. Oh, I'm an idiot. They don't even have any good flavors in there. Oh, that still keeps making that noise. Lemonade, banana flavored soda, a very yellow drink section. I think banana flavored soda would be good. You got anything else to say? No, okay. Do I need to find a key in order to get into that door? Ah, ooh, ooh, what's this? It looks like today's special is a slice of pizza and a drink for $1.50. The same as every other day. Got anything else to say? Okay. Are you going to say anything else? Okay. No. If we got to go back over here, then I don't see a key. I just need to interact with everything here. Ah! Free refill for water only. What's your with orange soda? Question, where do we get a key from? You hear that? That's the Torador March right there. Oh, I can. Let's not talk about that disgusting bolt anymore. <laughs> That's fine. Um. Oh, there's more stuff. I don't know what this stage is for. There's never any bands here. Ah, uh -huh. okay. The death floor looks like it hasn't been used in ages. Got anything else to say? No, okay. Whoa, wait, 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 wait. We got something. Should I have gone back here? Where are we? Oh, backstage. Okay. I don't want to go to the ball pit yet. We can, but I don't want to just yet. Ooh, what's this? I've never seen it just used it before. Explained all these stains on the floor. That mangle? Maybe not. Um. Ooh, wait, 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 we gotta look around here. Okay. So. Can't really see anything there. I definitely see Bonnie Guitar, maybe a Rockstar Bonnie Guitar, in the star. Um, there's an animatronic right there. I don't know who, though. Ooh, what's this stuff? Oh! That puddle looks like it's been here for a while. Hope it doesn't seep into my shoes. Oh, I would hate that, man. Is there a 
perfectly good mop right there. Wonder if Jeff knows it exists. Is there anything you don't wonder? Alright, um... It's locked. Don't think the ball pit is in there anyway. Damn it. Really? Man. Maybe we can't find any keys until we get to the ball pit. I'm gonna find out though. How do we get back? Okay. Alright, now we're back in here. Um. I guess the ball pit is probably through this door. I don't want to go there yet. Um. Can we go to this door? This door is locked. Damn it! You son of a bitch. Stop locking all your damn doors. I want secrets. I want to score secrets, man. And that door's locked. Okay, I kinda got no choice but to go to the ball pit because every door is locked except this one. Hey, it does exist! Ooh, this is creepy, this is good. It looks kind of gross. But I wonder what Dad would do if I hid and went missing for a while. Ah? Uh, maybe teach him a lesson not to leave me in such a creepy place all day. Damn! I wonder if that was his motive in the books. I don't know. Yo, you hear that? New objective, hide in the pit. I think you mean, dive into the pit. Oh, that's sick, that's cool. Look at that shit, oh my god. Oh, they thought of everything. Oh, this is good, I like this. I'm curious, is there actually a way to go back? There is. But we can't go anywhere but here, so it doesn't matter. WHAT THE HELL, OH MY GOD! <sighs> that scared the hell out of me, I'm not even kidding. Oh my god! I was not expecting that at all. Damn. I keep wanting to call y'all quick team. Cause that's the... That's who made, uh, five left. Who, uh, like a purple kitty or something? I am so sorry. But I forgot your name. I'm so sorry about Damn. That was a good jump scare. That got me good. Okay. Shall we climb into the pit? Let's do it. No, okay, not yet. Here's hoping I don't get pink eye. I think pink eye is the least of your worries, Oswald. Into the pit, we got an achievement. Into the pit, I must admit. I come, whoa. What the? I swear, I just heard it say, do not put someone else's head into an animatronic mouth. That's a Bite of 83 reference. That means this could take place in 1985. Or at least this time period does. We don't even know if this is canon. 
I hope it is, because this looks amazing. The cannon or not, this is a good game. I must say, like, the voice acting, like, the vocal acting is on the spot. I like it. Let's go out here and see what it's like. Let's look at Bonnie! Come on! Come on, you did it in the trailer! Do it here! Chica is definitely doing the chicken. What the hell is Frank doing? Oh, Frank's doing like that! Equity front, that's what Frank's doing. I don't know what Bonnie's doing, he's like... He's doing a little jig. He's doing like a little shimmy. It's so loud. This is a good beat. I like the Victoria area. Yeah, we'll go. Okay, enough of that. Let's, um... Let's get to the floor. Oh, actually, wait, go back. Can I interact with any people? Aha! Celebrating Kid. Bonnie is the best! Do you think he takes the quest? I don't know. Ask him. Okay, that's the same thing. Uh, how about y'all? Y'all wanna... Yeah. Nerdy Kid! Hmm. I heard there's a new game in the arcade. We should check it out. I bet it's rad. Nerdier Kid! I bet I can land the highest score before anybody else can! Nerdiest Kid! Um, actually, I already did. Okay. Uh, actually, y'all say anything else or do the same thing. Okay, it's just the same thing. Um, a new game in the arcade that sounds interesting. Okay, so we're in. Oh, that's interesting when you pause, or not really pause, but when you open the map, the music gets quieter. That's funny. I like that. Okay, so that's where we came from. Um... Employees only. Can we go back here? This door is locked. No shit. Doors are always locked. God damn it. Unlock, you son of a bitch. Alright, let's talk to people. Forgetful kid. I need more tokens. I think I lost mine in the ball pit. I think the game's lagging just a little bit. But, it's okay. Yeah. We're not going back to the pit yet. Um, I would, but not yet. Mike, wait, 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 wait. Hold up. There's a kid named Mike. Ooh, I wonder. Yo, dude, red coat. Haven't seen a get up like that before. Uh, thank you. I like your future of the flashback shirt. That's my favorite old movie. The movie's not gonna exist yet. I'm calling it right now. Shit. Old? What are you talking about? That movie came out like three weeks ago. Okay, so not exactly what I thought, but still I called it. That's like a cliche, that's like a kind of thing. It's like an old time travel film trope. 
that you mentioned that, like, Back to the Future is a classic example. You know, um, like he mentioned, like Marty mentioned, um, um, like F. Kennedy Street, and they go, who the hell is John F. Kennedy? Because, you know, F. Kennedy Street doesn't exist in 1965. Um, I'm nerding out so hard right now. Normally I wouldn't wear my glasses, but eh, honestly I don't care at this point. Chill out, he's just messing around. I'm Micah, that's Chip. You got a name, kid? I'm Oswald. Or Oz, if you prefer. Oswald. Like the wizard! <laughs> The Wizard of Oswald. See, it wasn't just me. Oh my god. The Wizard. Sure, if you don't know what Wizard of Oz is, you can get the fuck out of here. Of on of course. Oh, yeah, I saw that one once. My parents called me on. If that's where they got the name from. No, I think it's just well, okay, maybe, I don't know. How come we've never seen you around, Oz? Cause I'm the wizard. I'm uh from the future. That's a good question. All questions have answers. Ha, you're a funny guy. It's okay to be the new kid in town, Oz. The new mill in bringing a lot of newbies like you into town. New? Brand new steel mill. My dad works there. Mike dad does too. Heck, I bet that's where your dad got you. Uh, what? What? Chip, dude, you're stressing the newbie out. Let him have some fun while he settles in. Come on, man. You wanna play pizza roll with us, Oz? I need to try to keep up the voice. That sounds fun, but I don't think I'm supposed to be here. Well, where else would you be? There he is! Come on, man! I want to talk about more movies with you! It's so bad. Follow us to the arcade! That's not a good idea. I don't know what's going on, but it couldn't hurt to hang around for a while. He's hiding in that gross ball pit, and who knows when that'll show up anyway. Alright, new objective. Meet Chip and Mike in the arcade. I want to see what this is. I'm curious if they'll let me in. This the word what? I am going to blow a gasket if one more goddamn door tells me that it's locked. I'm a lore keeper, god damn it. Yeah, I talk to these kids or they already do that. Hungry kids. Pizza! 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 I smell pizza! 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 I love that. Oh my god, come on. Pizza! <laughs> Hell yeah! Alright, um... Rules for safety. You can't see if they're the same though, because it's non-existent. That's the menu... Um... Yeah, it looks like we might be going into the... Arcade very soon. Oh! You know what I should do? I should go uh, backstage and see if that's any different. Or should I wait till later? 
Maybe I should wait till I- I don't know, we'll see. Pizza snob. That kid eating macaroni and ketchup pizza? Yuck! I concur, what the fuck is ketchup and- I mean, macaroni and ketchup pizza? Macaroni pizza sounds interesting, but you put ketchup on your pizza? What the hell is wrong with you? I'm all for the evolution of pizza flavors, but that's an abomination. I agree. I agree. Ditto. Clearly, you've never had pineapple. Alright, look. I didn't like pineapple on pizza before, but then I tried it, and oh my god. It's delicious. Trust me, it's good. You gotta try it! You must try the pizza! If you don't try the pizza, I will come to your house, and I will kill you myself! I tried pineapple on pizza. It was good. I think it's not bad. Um, so, I'm sorry if you disagree with that, but it is what it is. Anyway, um, let's see. Pineapple on pizza? Yes! Oh, the humanity! You know what? I'm so sorry. How dare y'all say the pineapple and growth? Um, can I get around you assholes? Okay, I can. Um, can I talk to y'all? Foxy Pen? You think Foxy will be back soon? I miss him. Who knows? If I was out sailing the seven seas. If I was out sailing the seven seas, I'd never come back. Oh, it's a Foxy fan, not Pen. What the hell is wrong with me? Why do I keep reading the wrong thing today? But what about being covered in all that sea salt? Doesn't the thought just make you itchy? Honestly, kinda does. God damn it. Pirate man. Nothing wrong with being a salty sea fox. Build character. Rate my pirate voice in the comments. My throat is gonna be dead after this video. My throat hurts so much already. And we're still gonna keep going for another two hours. So. Um, is there anything down here? No? Again, good vocal acting. I like it. The audio is nice. Um, I'm gonna go backstage. And I wanna see if there's anything here. Oh, wait, I'm an idiot. I can't go backstage. Actually, what happens if I try to get up here? Oh, okay. The game doesn't let you. That makes sense, because I bet if you were to go backstage, if the animatronics weren't up there, that's when the real fun would start, and we're not there yet, so... Alright. Um... I thought I just heard crying for a second. Alright, let's go over here. I'm about to say Jet's not going to be here, but there's Freddy! And we've seen this, like, image before. Um, let's start with this. A uh, coupon for Foxy's Pirate Palooza. Yar har har! Yeah, nothing to say about Freddy? Question is, do the eyes follow you? No. Oh man. It is a cardboard cutout, but still. I wish the eyes followed you. They were present, though, that's interesting. Alright, what does this say? 
Pico flavored soda? I don't even want to begin to imagine how that tastes. Oh, come on. Give it a chance, Oswald. Give it a chance, man. Can I open this present? Oh, that was Quest. Oh, my bad. I can't open the present. Darn. Ooh, but there is something here. I see. Is there, is there anything at? Is there everything at all these tables? Oh snap! There might be. That's not good. Oh god. Reserve our party room for your next private event. Free official Freddy Fazbear cake with every reservation. Freddy? Who's Freddy? Oh, because Freddy Fazbear's was called just because. Okay, that makes sense. I'm about to say, boy, you don't know who Freddy Fazbear is. Don't know who Freddy Finster Fredbear is. You son of a bitch. I just made up that name, by the way. Um. Okay, so that's probably the same. I do want to actually go back, though. Just in case. Again, Lore Keeper here. I want to make sure I'm not missing anything. Is it raining outside? Oh, maybe, maybe. I should look around a bit. Oh, come on! Where's your sense of adventure? Fine. That vent looks sinister, though. Alright, let's, um... Just make sure there's nothing to do with Freddy here. I'm gonna give him a nice big hug. Alright. Now that we've had an embrace with Freddy, um, now this is going to be chock full of Easter eggs. Alright, let's see what we got. Um, can't read that. There's Ticket Eater. Um, let me just, let me explore the room first. There's Room Over. Okay, it's like Makeover. Oh, that looks like maybe free maze. Uh, maybe that's like a um, a fanverse thing. I'm thinking that's maybe like Chica's cupcake thing from Fury Breach, and that's Wackabon or Bonkabon, I should say. Um, prizes. Okay. Um, no, that, oh, these are like the 8-bit minigames. That looks like something from FNAF World, actually, that one right there. Um, next come money thing. Alright, what all can we interact with? Oh. It looks like one of those lighting pumpkins. Oh, okay. Can't see what that is. Um, can't see what this. Oh, or can we see what this? Nah. Okay. It's lagging a little bit. I will admit. But um, other than that, it's fine. It says I need a game token to play. I wonder where I can get some. Dad said he loved this game when he was my age. It does look pretty fun. I see an arcade right here. Not in Dracula, though. Okay. This thing is really lagging a bit. I will say. I don't really want to turn it down, but...
Got a fork in my hand here. That should work a little better, I think. If I had a voucher, I could redeem it here for price. No retro. Doing kid. Wouldn't it be great to have a hamburger on your pizza? That true, it would be. Just imagine it. Hmm. All the goodness of a hamburger. Or flat. What are these voices I'm doing, man? But why? Hmm. Whoever tried to hold a huge burger with one hand while you play one of those arcade games, it's impossible. All the insides fall out. You can hold a pizza slice with one hand. Huh. I think you're onto something. It doesn't look as fun as the other one. Okay, anything else okay? I'm gonna double check from now on, don't worry. Alright, let's see. Wow! <gasps> GGY! Whoever GGY is has the top score on every game. They must be really good. Ha ha ha! GGY! That's a security breach reference. And a tail reference. Wait. Oh, see, this is really gonna blow your mind. Because... If... If this game causes Fright to be canon, imagine if Tails and imagine if Seeker of the Mimic make Tails canon. Fright and Tails both being canon. That would be crazy. That'd be wild. I don't believe it either, but still. Funny if they make a GGY reference here, that's nice. Actually I forgot, is that that is a Tails story, right? Yeah, that's a Tails story. Okay. Nice! It says I need a game token to play one where I can get some. That's how you love it. Oh, okay, so now they're just repeating lines. Right? Yeah. GGY! I'm going to get all the GGY stuff because why not? GGY! This is going to be a long video. Alright. Um. Shall we talk to y'all? Have you seen Vendrelix? What about Vendrelix versus. Mecha Zendrelic. Is that Godzilla or something? Have I? I love Zendrelic. I knew it. A kid with taste. Finally, someone who appreciates the classics. You got anything else to say? No, it's like it's just the same mumbo jumbo. Alright. How about you, Mike? Dude, have you ever played Pizza Rower Oz? Not Pizza Rower, but I've seen something like it. This is the latest and greatest model from Fazbear. So I'm not surprised. Pretty exclusive stuff we got here. What's Fat Bear? Uh oh. Ha! A kid who doesn't know about Fat Bear? You're a racket, dude! 
here. Grab a ball and we'll show you how to play. You'll go up against me first. I'll go easy on you. Maybe. <laughs> Ooh, cutscene. Never mind. Okay, so the goal is to score as many points as possible by rolling the balls into the ball bearings. Oh, I saw this in the final trailer. Um, flyer ball. Yeah. There's a ramp on the end that's going to send your ball flying. So you really gotta con control your speed. Um, I'm not that good at fireball in real life, so we'll see how I am in game. Check this out! I'm not that good in real life. Show off. Give it a try, Oz! <coughs> ah, my throat. It burns. Oh, my throat hurts. Alright, um... Bummer! Oh. My turn! Wow, you're pretty good at this, Mike. Mike's the best pizza roller player in town. He's almost too good if you ask me. It's not like I try to be. I've just been stuck here all summer. Well, my parents work, man. I'll get rusty once we all go back to school, man. I'm thinking, you saying man, okay. Damn it! I was close. Here I go, man. That's the fine for all statistics, sir. School? Do you go to Westbrook too? Well, duh! Westbrook is the only school around here, dude! Okay, you gotta get, like, right to the tip. Damn it! I did it too early. Son of a bitch. Alright, let's go, dude! I were going to have a new teacher this year. Oh, wrong one. I were going to have a new teacher this year. I think her name is Miss Meekam. Miss Meekam. Meekam. How do you pronounce it? That might be from the short story. I don't know. And there is school in this game, so let's see. Last ball lives, make it a good roll. Ah, shit. Okay. Ha! Undefeated, man! Dude, you didn't have to go that hard on the new guy. Just motivate him to try harder next time, man! How about we play some tag instead? Oh, shit. I hate tag! <laughs> Uh, oh yeah, that'll give us a chance to show on around the place, dude. I think pushing back for some dude and man, I don't know what you do. I say, hell no. I say, sure. Rad! I'll be it first. We all close down here, Georgie. Oh my god, I need to stop doing these voices or I'm not going to be able to speak tomorrow. Oh god. Just two more hours of this shit. Get ready to run.
Are you gonna start running? You should start running on. Oh! Oh, you can do Oh! I got them mixed up. I'm an idiot. Crap, wrong button. Don't get caught. Wait, what? No! Damn it! Got you! <laughs> These play can pack today. I feel like I couldn't outrun you at all, Chip. Dude, you suck. I think you might be right. Everyone's getting their game on for school. Hmm. How about hide and seek then, dude? Now that's a game I'm good at. Hell yeah! You're on, dude. Wait, what? Oh, God. This again? You son of a bitch. Where am I supposed to hide? Bro, where do I hide? That door's locked. Bro, hold on. I can go in here, right? Damn it! Alright, let's start running! Bro, where the heck am I supposed to hide? Can I go in here? Oh, I can. Oh! Here we go! Oh, an empty suit. I bet they never check in there. Okay, here's something I'm curious about. Is Oswald going to be the fifth missing kid, the vengeful spirit, the way he should not kill? Is that what Angel the Pit's going to tell us? Because I'm actually very curious about that. June 1985? It's me, and I didn't even hide in it yet. So it is June of 1985. This really is just that movies. I hear footsteps. Better hide. Wait, what? You're showing how much noise we're making. Stay quiet. Ugh, I hope Mike didn't hear that. Gotta hide fast. Oh, that's bull! Come on, man. Oh. Ha! Nice shot by game, Chip! You suck, dude! Whatever. Did you find Oz yet? Not yet. Be quiet. I'm like you. <laughs> well, I. Maybe I'll find him first. Heh. <laughs> that would never find me. It's me. Oh, 
Uh oh. Oh my god, I did. That was quick. What on earth was that thing? Wait, 1985. Was that the was that the rabbit of 85? The fight of 85? <laughs> that came really quick. I was not expecting that. Glad well, I didn't see me. Probably not supposed to be back here. What's going on? This is getting good! Scared woman. Ah! What the hell is that? Scared man. Hurry! Grab the kids! Hello? Hello? Okay, that is not William Maxson. Because he has never killed children while the adults are there, like, not in sight. Like, he's always been nonchalant and secret about it. That is not William Maxson. That is something else. Anyone there? Chip! Mike! Michael! Crap! Going useless. Too many people screaming. Or it's zombies, I don't know. Where are they? Maybe they know what's going on. What's our objective? Look for Chip and Mike. Oh, shit's getting real. One eight eight three eighteen eighty three. Is that important? I don't know. Something is blocking it. It won't budge. I have to go out here. Yo, we're out of connect. He can chase you to this arcade. Yo, Rabbit can chase you through here, so... Do I want to go out here? I don't know if I want to go out there. It doesn't sound good at all. Let's try going this way. Never mind, we're not going that way. Looks like we're going the other way. This is getting good, I will say. This is getting good. Um, what the hell? Should I just leave? Is there a leave ending? I'm curious. Tell me there's a leave ending. Wait! Where do I go? What do I do? Wait. Oh no, did I make a wrong choice? Hold on, I'm so- oh my god. What did I do? Oh no. Damn!
that's an ending right there. Mega Cat Studios is their name. Mega Cat Studios, good job. I mean, so far, this is a good game. I like it. Vibe into this OST, I like it. That's just one ending of many. Um, now here's a question. Should we actually continue? Or should we wait for another video? I think we should maybe hold off for another video. I was not expecting that. I was not expecting an ending to come that quickly. So... Um, yeah, I was not expecting that quick of an ending, so... I don't know. Uh, I mean, I've been going for solidly probably like an hour and a half. Probably about the length of the Scott interview video, which that's pretty good, honestly. Um, yeah, honestly, I think we should hold off for now. Um, I still need to hold off on watching any videos, so I don't spoil the rest of the game for me. Um... So cool. That was good so far, I really liked it. Thank you for playing. At least this first round. Are you ready for round two? That's not really a jump scare, but, oh well. But, uh, yeah, that is Into the Pit, part one. I was gonna go for like another hour and a half, but I wasn't expecting it to an ending that quickly, so I think we should hold off here, um, because it's kind of dark in here because it's almost 6.30. Um, my throat hurts from doing those voices. And no worries though, I'll do more Into the Pit soon. I'll also do, I'll start doing Help 1 and 2 hopefully soon as well. I'll do more FNAF 1, I'll do more FNAF content in general. Um, by the time this comes out, obviously, the other two tenth anniversary videos will already be out that come prior to this. Those being the Scott interview reaction and my reaction to the Secret of the Mimic trailer. Um, because Obviously, because I didn't do anything with my pop goes because I wasn't really interested in that. t jock didn't work. I wasn't really interested in VIP. Um, yeah. Five laps didn't work. Um, but yeah. So that is the first end of the pit video of more to come. Now, that's not all of my 10th anniversary videos that I'm going to be doing, though. Um, there's still going to be four more that we're going to do, not Into the Pit. All the other episodes of Into the Pit are going to be... I'm not going to like call them 10th anniversary videos. I'm just going to have them be Into the Pit videos. Um, but there's four more 10th anniversary videos to do, those being two videos on the movie... Oh, I'm sorry, five more videos, actually, that's funny. Two videos on the movie two videos on, like, tier lists, and one video where we sit here and listen to a bunch of songs. Um, not sure which one I'm going to do first. Uh, probably the movie stuff, actually. I might do that. Or maybe the tier list. One of those two things I'm going to do first. Um, I think... So that was Into the Pit Part 1. Um, I hope y'all enjoyed. If you did, leave a like if you want to see Part 2. Subscribe if you wish to see any other FNAF content, as well as other things I do. Some.
they're different than others. And, um, comment down below about the whole, uh, audio-visual thing. If that's turned off, I don't know what it is. Um, and maybe we'll also do, like, more playthrough. Like, maybe we'll, after we get to, like, all the endings, maybe I'll also do, like, a whole nother playthrough on the other difficulty mode. Maybe. Uh, we'll see. But, anyway, that is into the fifth part one. I will see you all next time. For, I don't know what. Um, as for Subnautica, I currently have episode 14 to 24, so I have like 11 different episodes I need to edit, which is crazy. I'm going to be doing episode 25 tomorrow, episode 26, I'll probably have to wait to do that until Saturday. Um, also, actually this weekend, I think I'm going to do the breakdown for Half-Life Part 1. I'm going to record it on Saturday, and then on Sunday I think I'm going to to whatever comes after that, I think Half-Life Part 2. Um, I do need to do more podcast episodes. Um, and I'll also, I'll also keep working on the film, Something Sick of This Way Comes. Um, I still have one scene, one short scene to do, one short audio-only thing to do, and then one big final long scene that I need to do. After that, it's just a matter of editing, and then making the final trailer, and then adding the hundreds and hundreds of captions, and then the film will be done. So, you know, and hopefully I'll hopefully I'll get that done soon. Um, I actually planned for the film to be released like either tomorrow or the fifteenth. That's not going to happen. Um, so my guess now is I don't know. Somewhere between the 20th and the 30th? I don't know. Um, hopefully that gets released soon. Hopefully I get the Scott interview video out um, within the next couple of days. And I will see you all next time in another video. Whatever it may be. Goodbye. My name is Detective James Walker of the LaSalle Police Department. If you have found me long, then you realize the world is changing. I left the LPD a long time ago, but I'm afraid that retirement won't last any longer. Today is October 1st, 2023. It's been like any other day, apart from my usual exhaustion. I decided to take a little rest hoping that everything would be fine. How very wrong I was. I've had strange dreams before, but this one... It still makes me shudder just thinking about it. It wasn't just a nightmare. It was almost like a vision. This is how that dream went. I saw the world in ruin. Lucella's entire population slaughtering each other one by one. Some, or rather most, just mindless killing machines. But there were some that were different. Some that acted in a way unique from the rest. Like they were obeying some outside force. I don't know what it was, but I've 
feeling it won't be long before I find out. In the heart of all this chaos, I saw a man, a man with power, a man with strength, a man who can see what others cannot. I couldn't make out who the shadowy figure was, but then I looked upon his face, and what I found frightened me to my very core. It wasn't just some random person in the center of the street. It was me. I watched myself brutally murdering thousands of people in cold blood, like who would walk in the damn park. It was looking into a mirror and seeing the reflection of myself and some twisted monster. I watched as the world crumbled. Lucella, the entire world, the whole universe gone. And then I found myself in this strange place, this darkness, full of strands of light interconnected to each other, but on dividing paths to one another. One by one, all those strands disappeared into nothing. Poof. All that remained were my cold, dark eyes leering from that void of darkness. Some crazy shit. I had awoken to an eerie feeling, almost like someone or something was watching me. I walked up to my office, only to see that the door was cracked open. Someone had been here. I called out. No answer. I was completely alone. Like I stepped into the room with both reluctance in my heart, but the burning itch of kicking someone's ass, I found this strange paper laying on my table. Someone was definitely here. I read its words aloud with both confusion in my face and fear in my eyes. I will give a brief summary of that paper. Let me offer you a deal. I can show you things unlike anything you've ever seen. Do you accept? I will be watching. All questions have answers. Great. It's wonderful. You know? All questions have answered my ass. The note was signed by no name, just one simple letter, A, original. One of the greatest questions I found myself asking in this moment is who is A? What is A? What in the hell is going on? Who could have been here? When? And why? And who or whatever this A is? Is he human? I don't know. Maybe I never will. For now, all I can
can do is wait for a response. More info will surely come to Thank you for